Good morning everyone. This is Jackie with Paper Cuts. I haven't been uh, doing videos on a regular basis. I have got some personal things going on and uh, trying to downsize and uh, reorganize and all of that. So I have a temporary makeshift craft room right now in my living room. And it's uh, not, I don't have all my stuff. But anyway, this morning I wanted to share with you a new journal that I've made uh, using a linen like tapestry. Uh, it's all sewn, that's the back with my logo on it. And I used some of the Amazon packaging, the bubble wrap, to make the cover. It ties with sorry silk. It's called Life is Beautiful. And on the front, I put a little bow, a sticker of a blue flower, a pink rose, some butterflies, uh, some vintage lace. Uh, I have an old book page that I gessoed and painted a little bit with some inks and uh, just a little bow, a daffodil, just life is beautiful. So uh, originally I had intended on walking, doing a couple of videos and sewing the, in the two signatures that it has and decorating it but I got so into it I forgot to turn on the camera <laughs> so I apologize but let's get started <coughs> it's kind of chunky it uh, measures six and a half <coughs> excuse me <clears throat> by eight and a half uh, like I said it has two signatures in it it's got uh, 44 or 48 pages in it. I forgot. I'll count them when I list it on Etsy. Uh, so I'm going to move it over a little bit so we can see. The inside cover is some paper that I found. Put a little pocket and a little note card that it says, Expect Happiness. It's got a twill binding on it. Uh, this beautiful blue rose paper. And like I said, there's uh, two signatures in it. I use some coffee dyed paper. Here I put a pocket with a journaling card on it. I used an old receipt, some of uh, G Kerr's uh, words, a doily, uh, some of Artie Mays's numbers, and then sewed it with a little tab. <clears throat> it has grab paper, writing paper. Here I just sewed a ruffle fabric on it. And on the other side it has a paper clip. In the paper clip, I just put some extra writing paper that folds out. It's coffee dyed. It has a little blue bird on it. It says Blue Daisy. Has a card that says Grace. And another card that says Find Beauty in the Ordinary. It's such a pretty day out today. The sun's shining. It is kind of cold, but uh, it is still beautiful. Uh, ledger paper, some more writing paper, some of the scrapbooking paper, and on this side I used G's freebie, one of her Friday freebies, and made this uh, pocket. It's a tuck spot, so you can put whatever you want in it, a letter or whatnot has extra journal page in it and then this little butterfly uh, 
card with roses on it. This is a uh, old school paper that I tea dye or coffee dyed. Just put a couple of stamps on it. I probably should glue those down because I don't think the sticky's that good. Some more writing paper, graph paper, and that's the middle of the first signature. And on this side, I did a little notebook and it folds out and you have all this writing space. There's lots of journaling uh, space in this album. Uh, so if you're a journaler, you'll have plenty of room for writing. More coffee dyed papers with just great expectation sticker on it. Uh, a velvet ruffled edge. Here I made a pocket with Artie Mae's Vintage Ladies on an old book page of a ship coming into port in water. And then I used one of the uh, gold seals that I had with a daisy and some bling in it. And then on this card I used some freebies uh, and some old scrapbook paper. It says hopeful on it. So you can journal on that. More writing paper, ledger paper. You can make a pocket out of it, of it if you want. Writing paper, believe. Graph paper. Some more uh, coffee dyed paper. And then I did an envelope. It says, cherish every moment on the inside. It's all decoupaged with treasure, some numbers. Uh, those were all different kinds of papers I used, some old postage stamps. And, oh, it opens up and then you can tuck something in here as well. And then on this side, I did those uh, Gail Augustinelli got them from someone and it's a just a fold out and then it has two pockets and then these were freebies from red dot books and printables uh she has an etsy shop uh and i used those those were free printables some more writing spots another printable from red dot i used a chipboard piece with a fabric ruffle. Some more ledger paper. Writing paper. On this page I put follow your own heart pocket with just a little flower in it that you can write on the back. And it's a little pocket. Um, some more coffee dyed paper, graph paper, on the inside I put one of those fabric roses that I have on the front, here I just used a sticker of, I believe it's an, no it's not an iris, it's kind of a purpley blue color, it says beauty with a butterfly and more of the pink ruffled. It's a velvet. It's really pretty. Feels good to the hands. And then on this, I just did a little side flip of fabric and glued this little sticker on it. Ledger page. Copy dyed paper. A little butterfly. On this, I put a pocket with some, it's like a blue color. It's it's one of those three-fold pockets, but I only have two items in it. I did a little card here and cut it out so you could see the fabric tab. This is a book page. I used a little washi tapes of butterflies. So you can put another item in here. And then in here, I did a, tag 
with some twine. It has good writing space on it. And then a little butterfly up here and then the back of the book, which is, I just left blank. You could put a pocket on it or you could just write on it, uh, whichever you'd like. And that's it. It will be on my Etsy shop when you see this video, which will probably be Monday, uh, February 21st, I believe. Um, I don't know where my sorry silk went. Oh, here it is. So uh, it does, it is kind of chunky. <laughs> uh, but again, it's uh, got lots of writing space in it and two signatures. It's five and a half, no, six and a half by eight and a half. So it's a good sized journal. It um, has this squishy feel to it because of the bubble wrap and it's really, uh, it feels good in your hands. You could pro possibly, if you carry a large purse like me, tuck it in your purse. But um, I appreciate you watching it. I hope you enjoyed it. Next time I won't get so anxious and um, do it before I show you on camera. So uh, I hope everybody has a blessed day. And... Um, Please check out my Etsy store. It's Paper Cuts by Jackie. And subscribe down below. Uh, I'd like to try to uh, definitely get my subscribers up because uh, it is something that I'm working on. I just have to be more consistent with my videos. So thank you for watching and have a good day. Bye-bye.